that must be my first patient for today. Hmm. An old face. Someone I didn't think I'd ever see again. Well, well, well. If it isn't one of the best the Leaf Village have to offer. Itachi Uchiha. Please, take a seat. So, Mr. Itachi, if I may, uh, just Itachi, <laughs> you, sorry, are one of the greatest big brothers in anime history. You have a great KD record. Uh, you're also one of the coldest ninja to ever live, and you also love your brother. You're also responsible for... Killing off your entire clan. Itachi, exactly what's eating you? Is it the death of your fellow clanmen or clansmen, or is it just like, are you worried about your brother? Like, what, what's going on, buddy? To be honest, I'm just worried about Sasuke. He's always been clouded. His judgment, anyway. As I told Naruto, I told him that Sasuke was a blank canvas. And he can be painted any color at any given time. Since my departure, I've been keeping a close eye on Sasuke from beyond. And I can't help but wonder if I changed or did something different, would Sasuke's life still be the same? Or would it still turn out the way it did? I am to blame for how Sasuke is. It's my fault that my brother is the way that he is today. Itachi, I'm not going to sit here and sugarcoat the fact that you are the main reason as to why Sasuke left the village. And you are the reason as to why Sasuke was so revenge-driven and, revenge -driven and just wanted to <laughs> basically avenge everybody in the clan. Especially those he held close like your own mom and dad. But you can't anything after that. Well, anything after that, as far as concerned, after you told Sasuke the truth, that was on him. Sasuke is the one who said that he wanted to be Hokage and formed the village in his own way. He's the one who wanted to go down these paths to try and get to you, yes, but nobody told him to go to Orochimaru. Nobody told him to give in to the curse mark. Nobody told him to go down a path away from the hidden leaf. He's the one who did that himself. I suppose you're right, but still. I'm going to tell you something, Itachi. In life, we're, always, we're all going to be held accountable what we do but at the end of the day the person who did it is the only one who has to worry about it yeah you might have been the reason but you're not the person who did exactly what Sasuke did you might have been the catalyst that made this whole thing transpire but you're not the one who physically told Sasuke to do everything that he did Last question. Yeah, what is it? Do you think... Do you think that Sasuke, as well as mother and father, do you think they'll forgive me? Itachi. Itachi. I 
I'm going to say what the entire Naruto fan base thinks. You're one of the greatest big brothers in anime. You did everything you could to look after your little brother. And I want you to know that no matter what, dude, I think your family will forgive has already already forgiven you. And Sasuke, like you said, like you seen, is doing good. Naruto is keeping him in check. That's good. So, what do you say? Do you want another the session? Maybe soon. I, uh... I heard that I'm an uncle. <laughs> yeah! Sarada Uchiha. Now the youngest Uchiha to actually awaken her shouting gun, if I'm not mistaken. going to be great i know i know itachi i know well then i guess that's all the time we have um is there anything that you want to say for anybody who want to listen yes we forge our own paths don't let one choice screw your entire life up Because when it's do or die, whatever that choice was, you're going to have to live up to it in the end. Alright then, thank you for your time. No problem, Itachi. Thank you for yours. Enjoy the rest of your day, sir. <laughs>